These days, tech support scammers have a lot of experience connecting to Windows 7, Windows 10 computers. They go through their script and try to sell you things that you don't need for a problem that doesn't exist. But what would happen if they were faced with a Windows 95 computer? Would they even notice what was going on? Or would they just keep going through their script and act like they know everything about technology? For this video, I installed a Windows 95 virtual machine inside of my Windows 10 virtual machine. So I would allow the scammers to connect to my Windows 10 box and then displayed the Windows 95 one for them in full screen. There was no internet connection on the Windows 95 machine and they're not gonna be able to open the run box and type in netstat to trick me into thinking that there's hackers. So we'll see what happens. Thank you for calling support. This is Chris, how may I assist you today? Hi, hi, Chris, how are you? I, uh, hi, I'm sorry I'm calling so late, but I, I was on the internet trying to look up a recipe for my Christmas goose. I, you got to get it started about a week early, and I'm I'm already behind. I'm already, and and now it's telling me that I have a an error. There's an there's an error on my screen. Okay, I, I don't know why. All right, uh, now what do I do with the computer? It's uh, I'm yeah. looking at all my little avatars that all I can right. now track. You but... have your. Oh, good. Well, thank you for helping me because I would never be able to do this no by problem. myself. No problem. That's why I'm this employed. It's very complicated. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I hope they pay you. I hope they pay you very well for this. Yes, of course. So you click on the run. Are they pay? They are paying you, right? This isn't like a free service or anything, like community service or something. Did you, yes, oh, did you do something bad? Yes, it, it, did it's you a get in trouble service. and now you're doing community service? No, no, no. We are doing it for the paid service. No problem for that. What I was asking that you get a run saved. Okay. You got it? Yeah, I'm not talking to a criminal or anything. Okay. Okay, good. It says ID and password. No. Right. Tell me your ID. Just give me a moment. So this is the computer that you actually use? Yeah. Yes. This is my, lap this is my IBM um, vintage laptop. All right, 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 right. Leave your keyboard and mouse to me. Let me go out and check it out. Okay. Just give me a moment. Mm -hmm. How old the computer is, Miss? If I had to guess. Uh, uh -huh. How uh, old the computer maybe is? Maybe 22 years old. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, just give me a moment. Let me check it out. I haven't seen this computer in a while. No matter, I will fix it for free of charge for you. The computer, just you have me in a, you gave me an opportunity to check the computer, right? Because it's been a while that I was not right. seeing this Windows one. So just give me a moment. Let me check that out and I will fix it for free of charge, right? Okay. All right. So just leave your keyboard I, I and mouse. Let like me take it off the rest. They... It, they don't have the virus message and it's not Windows they're expecting, so they're told to act. Miss, can you click on the start icon? Like they're legitimate because they figure that they're recording and they on don't the want to get in trouble. On the computer screen, you yeah. have a start. Can you click on that? Okay. Yeah, please click on it. All right. And then, uh, okay, just give me a moment. Let's click on the settings. Oh, I think you want me to click on settings for you. No, no, you no seem problem, to be having no a hard yes. time using the mouse. <laughs> no, actually, you are using the mouse, right? You leave the uh, computer to me, I will take care of it. Okay, good luck. All right, so just leave it to me. Okay, so I can go ahead and fix the computer mess, but it will take two hours and there will be charges of $500 to fix the problem. Will that be fine? Because it is a pretty pretty much old computer. We have to reinstall uh -huh. everything that is an older thing. That's a Windows computer. So the payments will be high. So there will be a charge of uh, $500. Is that okay for uh, you? Could you tell me, could you, could you at least tell me a little bit about what the problem is? Um, the problem is you've been had. I've been what? You've been hacked. 
I've been hacked, you're saying? Yes, 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 that's what I'm saying. Okay, I don't even... I don't even think I'm connected to the internet, That's how? okay, thank you. That's okay, man. No problem. Thank you so much for giving an option to explore the Windows 95 again. Bye-bye. <laughs> I don't even know <laughs> what to say about that one. I thought that he wasn't going to scam me even a little bit, like even offer to help me. He said he was going to fix it for free. Now, you will see option yes. Do you want to make any changes? Just click on yes. Where is that? Oh, it says secure What do you server. see, by the way? Would like to access Click on computer. okay. Okay. Yeah, click on OK. Just allow me a moment. Let me check. Let me check something. OK. Thank you. <laughs> this guy's jumping right into it, too. The malicious. He's just. <laughs> just run the MRT program. <laughs> like... <laughs> wow. You know? Guess he's just really excited to scam me. Now, can you please tell me what exactly you were doing on the computer when you got this alert? On There's definitely, some... definitely something weird happening because he can't do what he wants to do. Well, I was trying to get my internet mail well, can... to figure out to, fi to figure that out. You're... Okay, you're trying to get your internet mail, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And which windows are you using, Matt? Uh, the old ones. Well, but under the system information, it says that it's Microsoft Windows 10. Is this Windows 10? <laughs> That's so true, because he's technically connected to Windows 10. <laughs> can, you, can you close this one? Can you can you X that X this untitled notepad? I'm having trouble controlling my mouse ever since you got here. Um, do you remember downloading if your grandpa would have downloaded something new on the computer? I, he probably did. I let him do whatever he wants on my computer. Mm -hmm. well, it seems to me, ma'am, that your computer has got infected with a kind of, you know, uh, with a virus or something. Um, Oh, God. Really? That's right. So can you call your grandson and ask him, you know, if he remember downloading something new from the internet? All so right, you can well, restart your computer, ma'am, and shut oh, it down. Oh, I got it back. Get it fixed from a store, okay? I can see everything got now. Got it back? That's yeah, wonderful. As soon well, as it... Yeah, I would... I would I'm just. Mm -hmm. It says remote control stopped. Now I can see my old computer. Thank you. That's wonderful. You're welcome, ma'am. Well, thank you for fixing bye -bye. it. Bye-bye. Merry Christmas. Bye-bye. <laughs> what were you doing exactly? Can you come tell me again when you got the problem? I was trying to figure out my email inbox. Okay. My internet mail. Be online, let me go ahead and check out the problem, okay? All right. How long will that take? Probably asking his boss, like, what is this? <laughs> what do I what do I do? What do I do with this? I'm going I'm check going I'm checking just be online, okay? Also it's really hard to move the, to use the mouse. Okay. Am I using your mouse? No. Who is using the mouse on your screen? Are you moving the mouse? Yeah, I'm not able to do anything. Uh, 
Hold on. Well, what do you need me to click? It's... Hold on. I can do... My grandson taught me... Don't do to... anything. Don't do anything. Don't do anything. Leave it. Don't do anything. Okay. My grandson taught me how to do this. I have to find the mouse. Oh, mouse. Because sometimes it's very hard to use. You have to... Go over to here. Here, see if this helps you. Okay? Is that easier? Leave it. Let me check it. Okay. I just want to make sure that there's not any more problems on it after I got that message. Because when I restarted the computer, the message wasn't there anymore. But... I thought this is so ridiculous. Why is he on the phone with me still? What is he doing? Do you think he's just asking his boss what to do? No way is he doing this. No way is he typing is that you typing i was checking the trouble actually okay <coughs> sorry my guy but <laughs> it's called dos <laughs> What type of activities usually you do on this computer, ma'am? He was gonna do it too. He's gonna scam me. Hold on, let me let me just open it up for him. Maybe I think go. on your keyboard. I think you should check your key keyboard, ma'am. I don't know. I'm. I think my keyboard's okay. It's a little. It's a little dusty, but <laughs> it's a little dust on your Sorry. keyboard. Okay. I just realized none I'm of this. I check each and everything. It looks like the computer, as I told you, has already hacked by someone. This is the reason your computer is taking a long time to fix it. <laughs> so it will take around one hour to fix every problem. Okay. It's not connected to the internet. Oh no! 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 Don't shut it down! Don't shut it down! All right. Uh, okay. Uh, well, how do I fix it? All right, I'm going to fix it. There is a one-time charge in order to fix it. That is cost you two forty-nine ninety-nine. Sorry, say that again. I couldn't quite hear you. So there's a one-time charge to fix the problem. That is two forty-nine ninety-nine. And the problem was that my computer is hacked. Correct. Sorry. <coughs> Hack. Yes. Yeah, we have to remove all the hackers, clean everything, and remove all the issues from it, okay? Okay. Now, did you In double, did you double check, just to make sure, did you double yeah. check that there's a valid internet connection on this machine? Or did you do any basic? Di what kind of diagnosis did you do to find the hackers out of curiosity? No, because I have seen, because you are not doing anything on it, and even I'm not trying to do Somebody is trying to control on your mouse already. We have to remove these things. Oh, he hung up on me. <laughs> I can't believe that. I re I didn't think that we'd be... I, okay, I, I, I did think that eventually we would get somebody that would do this i just it's i thought i would have to try you know like maybe one out of ten tries i guess this shows the scammers don't really care that much about what's actually happening on your computer they just want to make the sale i mean these guys couldn't even go through their script and they kept trying to scam me <laughs> i hope you enjoyed this video know that you are loved valuable and that you matter